Given the current coronavirus outbreak in the world, here's all we know about COVID till now. The novel coronavirus is a new strain of virus that was first detected in Wuhan in China in December 2019. It comes from a large family of viruses which cause several kinds of illnesses, ranging from the common cold to more severe symptoms such as acute respiratory syndrome. With the number of cases increasing rapidly across the globe, the World Health Organization has declared it a pandemic. Various countries too have taken several measures to contain the spread of the virus. The US has declared a national emergency to handle the outbreak and has imposed restriction on several countries. Many countries are under lockdown including China, Italy, Spain and France. On the other hand, several nations have sealed their borders and restricted entry of tourists and have imposed travel restrictions. A recent study conducted in Britain stated that with no mitigating measures, the outbreak could have caused more than half a million deaths in Britain and 2.2 million in the United States. The Indian government has suspended all tourist visas and has launched a helpline number for all states as well. A total of 147 positive cases have been reported in India. Screening at airports and railway stations have also been strengthened. In Assam, no positive cases have been reported till now. But the government has taken several preventive steps to prevent coronavirus spread. All educational institutions, gyms and swimming pools have been shut down in Assam. Further, parks, museums and public spaces have also been closed. Mandatory screenings are being conducted at airports, railway stations and other places of importance. As of today, coronavirus has claimed 7,975 lives, whereas more than 1,99,689 positive cases have emerged from across the globe. Just to compare, here's a look at the global deaths which have occurred due to various reasons. As per the World Health Organization in 2016, heart diseases and strokes account for 15.2 million deaths. Chronic obstructive pulmonary diseases claim 3 million lives. Lung cancer caused 1.7 million deaths. Lower respiratory infections 3 million, diarrheal diseases 1.4 million, tuberculosis 1.3 million. HIV and AIDS 1 million, road injuries 1.4 million. While doctors and officials have said that there is no need to panic and to take precautionary measures, experts have suggested a few ways in which you can ensure your and others' safety. Wash your hands frequently with soap and water. Do not touch your face and mouth. Maintain a safe distance from someone who is coughing or sneezing. Avoid large gatherings. If you develop any symptoms like fever, shortness of breath, get yourself tested at the earliest.